against criminal activity. That's a state jail felony. Well, a new bike track will be coming to Harlingen. The Valley Off-Road Bicycling Association was recently awarded a grant to build a pump track in the city. A pump track simulates the hills and turns cyclists can expect to encounter on an off-road track. Well, the new track will be located in Arroyo Park. Varva partnered with the city to donate the grant money it received in exchange for the city donating the land. The group says they want to have an area where kids can learn to ride their bikes in a safe environment. A lot of those skills can be taught on a pump track and the best part is you're not on a trail somewhere where you could have a crash and be in the middle of nowhere. You're in an enclosed environment. Well, he says he hopes building the pump track inspires other cities in the area to do the same. He also hopes the facility is up and running before next summer. Well, it's officially fall, y'all, and that means many people are excited for pumpkin season, just like me, which is good because Danielle's got info on one event that looks like a whole lot of fun for the entire family. Yeah, Adam, you were just talking about pump tracks. I'm talking about pumpkins. Are you cool with that transition? <laughs> I'm cool with that. That works. <laughs> Very cool. I'm excited about this. It's an official pumpkin unloading event, and that means it's literally time to bring out the fall season pumpkins, unload them from the trucks, and set them all up for you to enjoy. Now, it's all happening this Saturday in the city of McAllen and it's a community event for everybody to take part in. I'm so excited about this. It's a great way for everyone to get uh, just together from our Rio Grande Valley community and enjoy some fall season excitement. And of course, a pumpkin patch means lots of photo opportunities for individuals, families, couples, friends, neighbors, everyone, coworkers too. And it's kind of cool to know that you could be enjoying a patch that you set up just the way that you like too. Plus, who would have thought that unloading pumpkins would actually be a great way of working out? You see, it takes a lot of upper body and even lower body strength to get the pumpkins off giant vehicles and onto the way, you know, the haystacks that they need to be at. And if you do want to move them around for different photos, um, then all that moving around sure does make you sweat, especially if it's already hot outside like the way it has been lately. So it's pretty cool to know it could be a workout. There will be the beginnings also of what looks like delicious pumpkin pies and other homemade pumpkin goods. And entrance is free. So all you have to do is just get there, have fun and maybe roam around to check out the other festivities that are going to be happening there on site. Uh, so again, it's all going down in the Upper Valley and you can bring the kiddos and even your dogs to have fun at the patch. Now the address is going to be found right there on your screen and you can visit the displayed website for all the info. We hope that you're able to make it out there and have fun and of course, happy fall. Guys, I love that we have some pumpkins here on the table. Yeah. It kind of gets us excited for this event. No? We're sure we're getting in the fall. <laughs> False spirit spirit yeah <laughs> mood we're false falling spirit. for fall uh, is there a false spirit <laughs> yeah. there's a holiday spirit <laughs> that's awesome there's spirit for everything there is i have fall spirit <laughs> this, this is great i love that it's a workout i don't know if y'all have been to pumpkin yeah. patch you pick out your pumpkin they can get a little heavy <laughs> yeah upper body and well, they're big uh, you're carrying these things around they're kind of awkward it's like yeah. a giant ball i'll yeah. unload these these are nice these, yeah these exactly are i love that you get to set them up how you want i don't know if you guys have ever also like gone to take pictures at a pumpkin yeah patch. for sure some of them are different colors. You can arrange them the right mm -hmm. way. So it's very decorative. So that's a really fun different opportunity colors? to be able to arrange go. Arrange them the right way. Sorry, go she's ahead. Do you need some help over there? Yeah, that? she's arranging them the wrong way. Let's fix that right there. Sorry, Adam. <laughs> Actually, you've been working out. This should be easy for you. No, you can unload you ours. Work out you work out too. You do squat stuff and all that. Do, we saw this good. last week's show. We all got a workout in. Yes, <laughs> Jessica and I were like this. So we, you know what? Next time um, we have a fitness guest in here, we mm -hmm. need them to bring a pumpkin and show that's us how to work out with a pumpkin. That could be fun. Yeah. All right, you get on that. Yeah. Okay. yeah. <laughs> sounds like a really fun event. I, I love the pumpkin. I love pumpkin patch events. So this sounds right. I family. love pumpkin foods. <laughs> yeah. Everything with pumpkin food Everything. and drinks. There I'm you about go. it. All so right. please support pumpkin patches and then bring me some goods. All right. There you go. Yeah. Adam needs some. Well, thanks for the info. And still to come, syphilis cases are on the rise, and it's concerning doctors. We'll have some tips on how you can protect protect yourself. If you are just now heading out the door to school, know that when you get there, you're going to be in the upper 70s and after school, upper 90s. Some of us